So I said I'm passionate about customer service. I've, I've been in the business world for about 32 years. I started uh, in the business world here in Dallas in the telecom business, and I moved to Minnesota, chased the dollar all the way up there, like I said, and I was in the telecom world for a long time. And we start, I was with a couple of different startup companies, and we started a business in 1993 with five of us. And in 16 years, we grew that business to 500 people. We were about a quarter of a billion dollar business, which is pretty, it's pretty rare to, to, for a business. Gallup says that four in 10,000 businesses actually go beyond a million dollars. So we had a really great business. And as we were growing, we were making acquisitions. And, if, and, if, and just think about being in, a, in kind of a family business of five people and growing that thing to a nationwide coast to coast business of over 500 people. Today they're over 1,000. We kind of started losing our soul, right? And we started having attrition. We, had, we were losing good people, and we were losing good customers. And I went to, to Tom, who owned the company. I owned just a tiny little piece of it. And Tom owned the, the, uh, the lion's share. And I went to Tom, and I said, Tom, we need to do something. I had just read the, a couple of books I love to read. I read the book Good to Great Jim, by Jim Collins. And I read a, a Jeffrey Gittimer book about customer service. He says, customer service is worthless. It's all about customer loyalty. And I'm going to explain a little more about that here as we go. And I saw some things happening in our company that were not healthy. I said, we're a good company. But how do we take it to a great company? So I, I, I wrote a proposal for Tom. And I presented it to him. And, and I said, I want to do something different. I was the executive vice president of the company, and I was pretty much in sales most of, my, most of my career. And I said, I want to do something different. I want to do something, I want to call this customer excellence. And what I want to do is I want to go out into our company and go out into our customer base and, and figure out all of our touch points. So I wanted to look at all these different touch points and figure out why we were losing good employees and why we were losing good customers. And so I, so I invented this thing called customer excellence. And I started going out and, 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 and really digging in and, and, and questioning and querying and listening and talking to our employees and talking to our customers. And some, and some things started coming to light. And that's where I got my real passion for what's called customer service. You've got to have a culture internally that promotes good internal customer service. You've got to take care of one another. We're a family here. It is, is, it, is, is that the understanding, it's easier to keep a customer than it is to go get a new one, All right? And if you can keep the ones that you have and, and, and raise their level of, uh, uh, raise their, raise what it, increase what it, the benefit that they get when they come in here, then they will bring, there's a statistic I'm going to talk about, they will bring people with them.